Okay, the, ne the next group is very dear to my heart. As the leader of the group, we were in a play written by Earl Atchak in 1991. We made this play and we toured and became friends since then. We are welcoming the Anchorage Unangak dancers. The Anchorage Unangak dancers led by Ethan Pettigrew includes members from all ages, from nearly every region in the Aleut region, every village in the Aleut region. To carry on the legacy and to fulfill a vision, Ethan, along with several original members of Atkam Talegasnikangis, Atka dancers, Atkam Talegasnikangis, Atkam Talegasnikangis. We're happy you cried, and yes, you sound great. Thank you. Formed the Anchorage based dance group, which now has over 30 members. Many of the distinctive dancers performed by the Anchorage Unangah dancers were written and composed by the original members of Atkam Talik Niksakanis, who have given the Anchorage group permission to borrow their work. The Anchorage Unangah dancers dance group carries on the tradition of their predecessor. At Kam Talik Talikisnikanis Talikisnikanis Kamenak, he said I was, that's good and leaves audience in awe with their vibrant and energetic performances so let's give them some vibrant energetic energy in welcoming the Anchorage Unakak Dancer Ang way kang laga ka sakta kuk, unang am talagis ni kang sakus, Anchorage ilavan ang ifta kus. My name is Kang Lagik, and this is the Anchorage uh, Unangak dancers. And um, as as uh, Allison mentioned earlier, we are taking the songs tonight and using the songs from Atkak or the original ones that belong to Atkam Talagis Nikangis, and we are performing their songs tonight. It's a very special reason we're doing this. Um, half of our group is uh, missing tonight, and we know they're out there. Uh, we had a recent death in our community, an uh, elder who passed, who was one of the last two survivors of the internment uh, people who had gone been taken to Japan. Her name was Liz Galadoff uh, Kudrin, and we want to dedicate our performance tonight uh, in her memory, and we want to dedicate it especially to our family who is not here with us, approximately half, who are in mourning now according to our traditions and not to dance for a period of time and they're preparing for uh, the burial. So we want to reach out to them and know that their spirit is with us. And tonight we're performing to hold up our relatives in their time of pain. This first songs that we are going to do, we're gonna announce our first set and you can uh, watch it. The first one we'll be doing is called Tili La. It's a song and dance to clear the area of any negative energy. You'll notice that our group will start out, once we start dancing, we form a circle. It's very important in our Unanga culture. Um, very similar probably to our cousins to the north who use a thong walk, the center of the universe. Uh, we will push out though and open our, our circle up to the whole people after our first set there. We uh, start with a song to cleanse the area. Then you'll hear an ancient prayer, which is a traditional prayer men said uh, at the break of dawn, which begins our performance. And then we'll do throat singing, which brings the creation of our, we're telling about the creation of our ancestors in the islands of the four mountains. When we, two beings covered in hair fell to the earth, they landed in the tall grasses, and the grass buffeted them. They, one was male and one was female, and from them came our entire race of people. We populated these islands, and we, we eventually broke out in war with each other, which caused us to migrate west and east. That's what formed the Unangak tribes. And so tonight, when you see us performing this opening set, we're telling you about our creation. Instead of stopping in between in each one, our creation then goes on to Iming Hakasa Khan, which is a prayer the women did, which means bring it to me. And then we commemorate our falling ancestors from the skies. And in that, then you'll see the seagulls uh, flight, 
and then we move into an area where we love to go, and that's these beautiful women because we admire. So we're throwing a couple extra dances in this set. I have a lot to flirt with these girls. Uh, you'll know that one when the boy gets rejected, and then we'll end it with a little drum set before we go into our next one. Ladies and gentlemen, Unangam Talagas ni Congress.
we love hearing our cousins calling out out there, ooh, ah, when we're dancing. This next set of dances are slower. The more our story dances, uh, they all have different composures for them. The first is Ukchuk, and it was composed by a young girl in Atka some years back. This is a dance about puffins. After that, we're going into a dance called Agukyaku, which is about us traveling in a large open skin boat, followed by, uh, we'll be ready to see you guys get up when we invite you uh, to do Chagek with us, invitation, and then we'll end that set with Kanglagek, which is our raven. Ladies and gentlemen, Uchchumangachi.
Okay, we did our sit down dance for you. Now it's your turn to get up and do our stand up dance. Ah, or your stand up dance. We're inviting you to come down and join us, please. Uh, we're going to dance chugging. You can dance our style or any style. Just come and dance and move with us, please. Let's uh, come join our spirit and uh, help hold those up that are not with us tonight. Kagasako.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be doing our ending set and exiting right now, so it'll be last minute for us to speak. We want to first thank the Athabascan people whose homeland we're on for allowing us to perform our traditions here on your homeland. It's very special, and thank you so much for allowing that. Um, and once again, uh, we want to again reach out to our friends, our family at home who are in mourning and uh, in the memory of, um, uh, of Liz uh, Kudrin. Uh, we would like Vichnaya Pomyat, and this is uh, our performance for you, you folks at home. We love and we miss you with us. So uh, we're going to start with our tikalak, our eagle dance, but then we're going right into a dance that is isok or seal. And uh, from there we're going to do the last little quick one is Chugina the Mayaga. It's a volcano woman who comes out looking for her husband. She crosses the island. She finally finds him, but she's so strong she ends up killing him. But uh, shamans bring them both back to life, and, and, and it's all a good, happy ending. And then uh, we'll be doing one flirtatious thing, because in the illusions we don't have any trees, so we have to be really creative when we flirt. So you're going to have to figure out how that, what that trick is. By the time we're done, we're going to test you, and then we're off the stage. Thank you very much. Kagasa Cook, thank you, FNA, for having us.